Hey y'all, uh, here with a rigid 18 volt lithium ion battery. Uh, just wanted to make a video, show you a couple things I did when I had one not working. Actually, I had two of them not working. Um, but anyway, so I tore the one apart, and well, I tore them both apart, and the one had 18 volts um, to, you know, you can touch this side here. I think this is the positive, and you got the negative over here. Uh, this one didn't, but I was able to jump start it off of that one with some uh, jumper leads. You don't want to do that too long, but I was able to touch this side and that side, you know, get the negative and positive all hooked up and get them going. But on the one up here that I found, um, there is, if you clean up this board, there was a bunch of gunk on it. I had a bunch of uh, stuff all over this one. If you, uh, take like a brush, I used a nylon tipped one because metal I think would hurt it and I scraped it all up I got the board to recognize that um, uh, there was voltage there and stuff because when you press this button for the one that's up on the charger only one at the end would flash but even though I had 18 volts throughout the thing so I was able to clean it up and stuff and get it, it seems like it's working and I'm gonna use some of this uh, CIV clear insulating varnish. I don't know where else you can get this stuff, um, but it's uh, it's like a dielectric clear coating, and you can just uh, spray it right on your board, uh, even on the side here, and uh, it helps if you get any moisture inside this battery. It'll keep from that getting all corroded or jumping in places and stuff. You just don't want to spray it on these here because you got to connect up with your charger or your tool. So. Hopefully that helps some of y'all out. There's uh, also just so you know too. There's um, I'm trying to remember what this is. It might not. Uh... There we go. It's a T10. Uh, you won't need the long ones like I have. I got these at Harbor Freight. I think it's eight bucks or something for all of them. But that's a security tip too. Just so you know, you'll need that. Um, but there was like eight screws. You'll see them. These uh, there's four on the top uh, here, here, and on the other side. And then we take this out. This will pop up. And then you're gonna have two side plates. You can see the other one over here. There's gonna be a screw on either side of them. You won't be able to take those off till you take the top off. And they just sit along the side here in the grooves. So hopefully that helps some of y'all out. And uh, be safe and have a good day. Oh, and uh, if you have any questions or comments, put them down below. And uh, like and subscribe.